All right. Well, hey, thanks so much for tuning in today. Uh, I'm Jason Gamble. I'm with Georgia Northwestern Technical College and Office of Recruitment. And for the last uh, month and a half, we've been highlighting different programs across GNTC. Um, last month, we highlighted some programs in business technologies. And for the month of November, we're highlighting some programs in industrial technologies. And uh, we're so uh, glad to have Corey Allen with us today, instructor in, in the drafting program at GNTC. And uh, as you know, um, as far as the uh, mission of GNTC, it's all about training our workforce for the future. So um, drafting is just another quality program within the programs encompassed at GNTC. So we want to let Corey share a little bit about the program. So Corey, thank you for joining us today. And if you don't mind, if you'll, I'll sort of turn the floor over to you to, to share a little bit about the drafting program. All right. Well, thanks, Jason. Um, so a lot of people wonder what drafting is. Uh, and we get a lot of people who aren't really sure who still entered the program, but basically drafting is technical drawing. Uh, it, it means to take something you see in the real world, whether it be uh, architectural focused or um, some kind of mechanical shaped object and recreate it in a very accurate representation so that somebody in the field, such as a manufacturer or even, you know, an architect uses it for a firm to recreate that item. So basically drafters are on the front line of design, making things for everything you see around you, really. <laughs> uh, I'd say that's pretty much the biggest explanation, but, uh, you know, we, we do offer a few different programs here. Uh, we've got the associates option if you want to go on to a full degree. We have a diploma option as well. It's not a frequent, but you know, if you're wanting somewhere in the middle, that's usually a good spot. And then we also have a certificate, uh, which can be achieved in three classes if you're just wanting to get your foot wet in the program. So you've got options at least. Yeah. So definitely students could come in. Uh, yeah, definitely explore the certificate diploma for that next step and, and for that uh, to your program, to your associate degree. And, Absolutely. And, they all tie into each other if you want okay. to progress as you go. Yeah. yeah. So so all, all three options for those that are listening out, prospective students, and then maybe counselors that want to share this with students. Um, and then uh, currently right now, Corey, how, how is the format? Like, how are you doing the classes pretty much right now? Um, so everything is online. Uh, the only thing that because drafting is so hands on based, you know, you're going to have to do a lot of self teaching anyways, but I try to supplement that and I've got book work, uh, YouTube videos. And then once a week, usually on Wednesdays, uh, I will have like a, I guess you would call it a class meet, but it's unofficial. Uh, you can come, you don't have to, but basically that's your time to interact with me one on one, uh, or your classmates. We're all there. I can share my screen. They can share theirs. And we just work on any kind of issues that need resolving. So I usually have those all day Wednesday with all the classes, but technically it can be done 100% online or you can, you know, participate in that optionally as well. So there's, you're kind of getting a taste of both disciplines that way, at least. Um, and there's students, uh, as far as, I mean, we, we serve several counties and stuff like that as far as students that are willing to, you know, uh, drive over is the program mainly, it is housed at Walker, correct? correct. Uh, but, but there's that opportunity through online classes and stuff like that. So it really doesn't, doesn't matter the location of where they are. Um, and, and most, there might be a class or two, but a lot, a lot of it is offered online is what you're saying. Right. And, and not only that, you know, you need a pretty sufficient computer to run these programs, but uh, we've taken some steps towards, you know, protecting the students with online and you can actually go to any computer and remote log into the ones that we have in our drafting lab. So you don't necessarily need a fancy computer to take online classes for drafting, which is new and pretty great. You, you could be yeah. saving thousand dollars, you know? Yeah. Um, let's go ahead and, um, you know, I want to go ahead and interject as far as if, if people did have questions in the near future and stuff like that, your email address at the college is, is it C. Allen? Uh, it is at gntc.edu. Okay. So C A L L E N at gntc.edu. That's um, correct. You can reach Corey 
in that format and do, do you uh, do you have an office number that you have too or, or probably the email is the best way to contact right now right right um, i'm yeah. not sure what my number is yeah. so. <laughs> but, well um, yeah that's fine as far as um basically reaching out to him by email let me go ahead and give you if, if students did have any general questions as far as uh recruitment and stuff like that uh my my email address is jgamel j g a m e l at gntc edu and uh, my contact number and I'd be happy to um, if anybody had any question too was 706-764-3810 and um, so yeah I mean this a uh, lot of great opportunities in drafting um, when when folks maybe finish that um, that whatever program they have and, and whether it's certificate diploma and associate degree what kind of companies um, around the area there's different companies looking for folks in the drafting area right yeah right i mean you know pretty much all of chattanooga around here is uh manufacturing focus so the job placement is really high here in fact most of our students who at least are intermediate skill level are actually employed already we have quite a bit of notoriety here it seems like we get reached out by all kinds of people all the time asking for interns or full-time people who are still in school. So I yeah. think there's ample jobs. <laughs> you know, with Chattanooga right down the road from us, but also being in Northwest Georgia, Dalton, Rome, there, there's plenty of opportunities in the Northwest Georgia and Chattanooga area. And um, so um, any other things like if, if someone, I've got a quick question that, you know, a lot of times when I do uh, talk to students and stuff like that, and, or, or maybe, families too, just just trying to search out and see what they might be interested in. What what would be your advice to perhaps they don't know that they're in uh, interested in drafting and really don't know what it encompasses. How would you in talking to a student, maybe maybe sort of shed a little bit more light on, you know, how, how can they sort of explore to see maybe if they're interested in drafting and stuff? Well, I usually uh, choose two options. So I don't know where it's at, but somewhere on the GNTC website, we have a, um, a placement thing where you can take yeah. the test and, and figure yeah. out what you're good at. You're familiar, yes. right? Yeah, 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 yeah. We could definitely help them out with that. Yeah, yeah. Yes, that's one thing. Uh, the second thing is I actually just go ahead and, and show them my videos that I have via YouTube. And I just say, go take a look, you know, like see if that's something that interests you. Uh, you know, like you can pretty much Google technical drawings as well and just look and see. I'm not going to say it's the most exciting thing sometimes to people, but, uh, you know, you'll generally be able to look at it and say, oh, this is what I want to do. And some people may like modeling and may not like the detailing part. And that's one of those things where I think you really just have to kind of see somebody do it in order to confirm if that's something you like. But more often than not, if you're choosing drafting, you probably already kind of have an idea you want to do something on a computer you want to see a, a pretty picture you know and it's one of those things you just you got to put the time in and look at it i can't really do much besides present it to you and say what do you think <laughs> yeah yeah but definitely uh get information there and i know you'd be happy to share those that the information those videos and stuff like that so um Absolutely. yeah just want to appreciate um you know that that input and the, the sharing about the program um Drafting has been around for a while here at GNTC, and so we're still glad to, to have it as one of our uh, programs highlighted in the industrial technologies. And I know if, if you have any questions in your future, uh, I know Corey would be happy to talk to you, and I'd be happy to share about what I can. And, and we just want to, again, highlight the programs. And, and uh, Corey, thank you so much for taking this time to, to share a little bit about the uh, drafting program. And, Anything you want to close with as far as about the drafting or, or you know, sharing as far as closing remarks? Um, not really. Uh, I guess, you know, you could say if you sometimes drafting can also be that intermediate step too. for some people, they might may want to get trained and get hired, you know, and go ahead and make money. Uh, and in that case, you know, some of your classes will transfer uh, if you decide to pursue engineering, which would be the uh, clear next step in progression if, if people are interested in that. So, you know, at the least, you're probably going to get a job pretty quick. You're going to make good money. And I mean, tuition's dirt cheap. <laughs> it's hard to beat that here. So, yeah, 
Yeah. Oh, yeah. And that's a good point as far as folks, if you are listening out um, and, and hear this, we, we do have tremendous opportunities through financial aid as far as uh, what we have available. Most of our students receive financial aid and through the HOPE grant, the HOPE scholarship, uh, it makes it um, very affordable, if, if not free uh, in, in some cases, if you're receiving federal aid and stuff like that. So very affordable. Um, and we, we just want to help you uh, with the resources we can to, to find that job or, or get that training. So, uh, Corey, really appreciate your time today. And, um, you know, like I said, folks, if you need to reach out to him uh, or myself, please let us know. Uh, Jay Gamble at GNTC and uh, Corey C. C. Allen at GNTC.edu. And, uh, Corey, appreciate your time today, okay? Appreciate it, Jason. All right. Thanks so much. Bye.